Um, Rob, congratulations, huge victory here this afternoon in terms of legs and everything like that. For, you know, Ryan Robin, done some real damage. Yeah, um, I don't know. And I played all right in places and sort of like you want to let it go and, and other things. I don't think the format really sort of suits me at the minute. You know, it's a bit short, it's a bit cutthroat. I like a longer format, but at the same time, still job done today and we're trying to aim for tomorrow, really do the same. Confidence must be so high at the moment. I see by the, the smile <laughs> on your face that you know you, you're playing well. Are you coming here expecting to win now instead of hoping? Yeah, it's no open, definitely. I won't answer the other bit, but there's no open. Um, no, game's there. Game's good. And, um, but yeah, it's weird, isn't it? You look at tournaments and, and you think, I've never gone out in the group stages before. But to be fair, that's, that's where I think it's lost or won. Also, one of your rivals, James Wade, losing as well. Is that any bearing before you went up there? No, nah, not really. Um, you've got to focus on yourself, and that's all I've done for the last well, however long. And um, you just worry about yourself. It's a dog eat dog, dog well, really. And um, James is a great player, and he has a great way of winning and stuff, and won his day to day. But fair play to Jim. So you duck out of doing the World Series qualifier. Did that help? You had some time to just chill after the Europeans and everything like that, and just get your game in a good place. Yeah, I think the game was always going to be in a good place because of the confidence. It was just trying to make that, trying to make that qualifier was um, a little bit tired, really. I suppose um, no sleep and stuff like that. But look, that's life. And to be fair, I missed it. I've got a bit more time at home with the kids, which I, which I was very happy with. Um, and and I suppose it done me no damage for the week because I went and won my first Pro Tour for three years. So yeah, in my in my personal opinion, I've done the right thing for me. Rob Cross wins on TV, wins on the floor. Alexander Palace on the horizon. <laughs> Looking forward to it. I am actually. It's going to be interesting, sort of going back. Um, I'd, I'd probably say I've had sort of like two years there. I've obviously, first year incredible, second year didn't think I played bad, um, and then since then we've gone for a little lull. But um, I, yeah. Yeah, maybe look to rectify that this year. Bobby, pleasure as always. Cheers, mate. Rob, what has that European Championship win done for you? Because it looks as though the, the swag is very much back. Yeah, I feel, I feel able again. Obviously, it's injected a lot of things, what I haven't had probably, probably for a couple of years, really. Um, I think, I think what it has done for me is, is obviously enlightened me and undone my eyes to sort of see that I can still win, I can still get in that winner's circle and still feel great. And um, yeah, the way everything is, there's, there's been a lot, a lot of work though to get me back, to be fair. In, a, in about a year or whatever, I'll probably look finished. But um, yeah, things have a funny way of sort of turning themselves round and, and doing everything. So um, no, I just suppose, yeah, I'm just looking forward to going up there now. We've got crowds back straight in front of them and, and just trying to put a show on and just playing to the best of my capabilities and if I do that then I've always got a chance. You mentioned a perfect record in the group stage in this event and you're giving yourself a perfect start. What do you make of the rest of the group between James Wade and Jim Williams? Look, they're both great players. Jim played very well. Um, James probably had a little bit of an off day today um, but at the same time there's so much to play for. Do you know, um, it, it, just because you lose one game I seem to find that I think I've I think ever since I've been here, I've maybe only once won all three games. And I'm not even too sure about that. So I've always won two and lost one. Um, but to be fair, I, it doesn't really change anything. It just puts a bit of pressure on and James is sort of, well, he's more than able, to be honest, to come out and change that round. Given the way you're playing and how confident you are, should the other players be fearful of Rock Cross at the moment? No, not at all. They've got, a, they've got a job to do just like me. And to be fair, all I'm going to do, I'm going to keep myself to myself and just play my darts and let them do the talking. Cheers, Cheers mate. Rob, the fact that you've won 5 0, 96 average, and you still feel like there's plenty more in the tank. I thought it was rubbish, to be honest. But, um, yeah, obviously, don't reflect of what I have been doing, but I think it's the Throat short format. It, it sort of makes you a little bit nervous and, and other things. I don't I don't think I was brilliant. I don't think sort of um, I sort of burst in the life and probably over a longer format you'll watch you watch a different player. But just at the minute for what you've got, I'm just happy to get the job done really. Cheers, Rob. Cheers mate.